Radial tunnel syndrome and tennis elbow can often be confused with each other due to the fact that the areas of tenderness on the dorsal forearm are in the same general location. Here you can see the different areas depicted more clearly. Here we can see the therapist identifying the lateral epicondyle versus the radial tunnel. The therapist is going to check if there is any pain with palpation to the radial tunnel or any symptoms elicited with percussion at the radial tunnel. Similar to the phalans, we can also check for compression neuropathy by asking the patient to extend the elbow and flex the wrist maximally to see if there are any symptom, symptoms present. Similar to a median nerve glide, a distal radial nerve glide, seen here, can help alleviate symptoms of a radial tunnel nerve compression.